Okay. I haven't played this game in a while. I'm just jumping in to see what's changed. Oh wow. Is that like different Ronnie? <laughs> That's awesome. U three five two Bismarck SS Yongala. There's a few coming soon. Ilma H. Ah, oh, there's more places to explore now. Before it was just a diving base. I'll show you the diving base real quick. Go public. Doesn't really make a difference whether you go public or single player. It just means that you can have up to three other people connect, making four players in total. <laughs> Man, I hope this game turns out really good. So far, I've been really impressed by the quality of the game. Um, I hope that they add a lot more wildlife. Before, when I played this game, maybe about three or four months ago, um, there wasn't a whole lot of wildlife to be seen. Um, crocodile level. What the frick? I want an Oceanopedia, come on. I'm all about the, the learning, and I'm all about like the wildlife and stuff, so... In any case, this is my character, as you can see. I am playing a female character, because it's always more fun that way. Um, say what you will about me. So that means... What? Five pearls. Whether that means I um, have problems or not, I don't know. Okay, I'm still getting used to these controls. Alright. So, this is the base. This is the base level, your home base. This is the level that everyone gets, at, or everyone got first go. So you can see, very tropical. Uh, you can see the big wide ocean out there and the dark pool here. You can practice out your skills. Um, you can choose that, you can select your gear, so you can even change your gender on the fly, so it's not fixed. Uh, you can change uh, your mask, make yourself look a bit cooler, I guess. I don't know. see if there's more options. So right now I'm using a, a basic mask. This is apparently a frameless mask, I, I'm not sure what that means. Some of these you need to actually buy. Rift mask, yeah, that's cool. Full face mask, that's kind of cool. I need a one pearl and a hundred coin. You can preview what the mask looks like. Uh, frameless mask means. Hang on, I'm not sure what that means. 
So this is a basic mask, which is what I've got now. See, it's got the, the skirts that block out the light on the sides there. Brainless mask. Not sure, it's a bit thicker. Like it's deeper. Not sure what that means. <laughs> That's awesome. That is sick. That's cool. Oh man. This game, this game could be really quirky. Or it could be really serious. You go either way. Oh, it's a full wetsuit. Full wetsuit. Got sleeve suit? Yes. Doesn't seem to change anything. Normally you get a preview. It's a different pattern of like bikini basically. That's cool. Full wetsuit. Did have a real skimpy bikini. Warrior princess. <laughs> That's awesome. That's pretty cool actually, that looks really good. That actually looks really good. I love those ab things that it has. Space Captain. Or like Star Trek or something, I guess. They actually look um, decent. They actually look alright. Uh, this one. But you're going for a, a normal swim. Wetsuit C. Uh, inventive names. I like it. I can change my BCD. We don't have many BCD styles at the moment. I suppose that would be a bit hard. Tanks. You can have different types of tanks. Australian flag. Totally there. All over that. It's not changing. Not changing. I wonder if I can reset this somehow. What? Not like shouldn't there be a flag on it? Oh, you need to, you need to equip it as white? Is that how it works? That's pretty cool. What's this aquarium cover? American flag. That's pretty cool. Basic tank. How's it cover? Extinguisher. It's a fire extinguisher. Dutch flag. Scottish flag. Blue camo cover. Sea pony cover. <laughs> pretty cool. Pretty cool. Blue shark. Kind of gay. I don't like that one. Union Jack's kind of cool. I like that. Very nice. Regs. It's only a basic reg. Buddies. Oh, you can get like fish as buddies? That's sick. Oh, what? I can get a bot? It's 50 pearls. Dang it. How do I get 50 pearls? A lot of pearls. Watch. I need a, do I need a dive computer? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Hands. Oh, like Hitman gloves. It's awesome. That is awesome. Belts. He wears the weight belt very stylishly. Not how you do it in real life, but then again, this isn't real life. Alright, let's go for a dive! 
this game is is super it's like just the most relaxing game you could ever ever play this is the like the maximum swim speed basically uh, I'm being serious it really is oh I got some doubloons awesome it's a daily mission. Get XP for daily missions. No! No, don't crash. Do not crash. So I'll show you, um, show you what this is all about. you get this little this little iris and this little tunnel and it leads it basically leads out into the wide blue sea you can find you have a you get you have a scooter scooters are cool you can't strafe obviously because you're underwater maybe we just want to make can let you can let go of it I think. No you can't. Uh you can pull out your camera. And I'm pretty sure you can drop your camera somehow. Get in the frame. Take a picture. You're taking a picture there. Then you can achieve the camera and view the pictures. View the pictures, damn it. How do I change? Oh, okay, whatever. So there's a dive computer. And this is your uh, your air, or your BCD control. So then you get this little, uh, little almost like an underwater aquarium, I guess, if that makes any sense. sort of like, a, I guess, a safe place. I'm not sure if that means that eventually in the game that the, the ocean will be a dangerous place. But this is a safe place for you to be. And you can exit. Like a boss. stuff. Uh, things like this, this is a challenge. No, I need a tool. It's not been made yet by the devs. Can surface. Can have a peek around. This is all running on the Unity engine, apparently. Pretty cool. Look at all those fish. I'd love to have an encyclopedia where I could just, where I could see what fish that is. This will get me around faster. I 
there's apparently no physics, you just kind of pass through everything. boost of speed. And then you can see it charging up down there with the blue bar on the, uh, the tools HUD. You can trigger it any time you have some blue bar, but uh, you just get a shorter boost. What's this? Group shot. Stuff that. Oh wow, that's kind of cool. Hello. That is kind of cool. Yeah, these devs have done a good job so far. I really like what they've done. It's not super realistic. Yes, it's awesome. Oh, I just love the feeling of being underwater. I need a torch. Someone give me a torch. Oh, what? It's awesome. The exploration aspect of this game is awesome. I love it. So much fun. Just swimming around, exploring the deep blue sea. I'm leaving the swimming area. Turn back. What happens if I don't? Oh, you get... Okay. Let us try. Let's try for a different scenario. Alright, sorry about that. I just had to quickly adjust my headphones and my mic. I'll go with new game, I explore the brony, go public. Okay, let's go diving. I like how they have the dive flag, then the the line. Where you can dip your face in the water, pull it out again. I wonder if you can use the boat. That would be fun. Nah, can't use it.
is okay. It said south. There's a there's you can see the blue flag on the dive computer there. It likely means that there's something there. Or if, or maybe that's my target for the daily mission. But um go exploring. Speed this up a little bit. Oh yeah, that's cool. They need a uh, they need a a lot. I'm not saying it's bad at the moment, but they need more detail with the coral, uh, with the rocks, and with the scenery, basically, because diving. Really, diving's all about the scenery and the wildlife. And, as you can see, there ain't much wildlife around. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess that makes sense. Like, every time you go diving, there isn't always an abundance of wildlife, but uh, it's a game. I mean, it's a game. But there should be just tons and tons of wildlife and just heaps of stuff to see. Because really, that's what this whole game about is about: is just getting out there and seeing stuff and exploring. Um, without that, I guess the game would get pretty boring. Because it's not about like fighting sharks or killing people or anything like that. Um, there's really a game like this. There's nothing to do as such, except to see stuff. So if they don't have a lot of things to see. People are going to get bored. Going inside the ship. I wish the ships were bigger. Ooh. What? That was empty? That's not fair. I wish the ship's interiors had more to them. Um. Yeah, it'd be so much fun to actually just swim through, like, the entire ship and through all of the the corridors and rooms and find the galley and find the bunk beds and all of that stuff. Like another pub. Oh yeah. I think that's like the peak of the excitement of the game or the gameplay elements. It's fun. It's finding pearls. What the hell? Is that like a UFO or something? So the Brony, um, the Brony shipwreck, I believe, is, um, was requested by a backer. So this was a Kickstarter game. And, um, the backer, at different backer levels you get I don't want, I don't want to do a daily mission I don't care about the daily mission or do I? let's go find the daily mission but yeah, at different backer levels um. At a particular backer level, you're able to actually request a shipwreck or request something like that. Or design your own shipwreck. I think this guy, if I remember correctly from the forums, actually just requested that there be a brony shipwreck. But he didn't design it, he asked the, the development team to draw it up and design it. But specifically as a 
be as a bloody shipwreck. So, oh man, I'm gonna fail this. I have no idea where that thing is. Oh no, my pearl. Damn you. seconds. Oh, ten seconds to go with the clutch photograph. Could check out the shipwreck from the outside. More interesting from outside than inside, which is kind of sad. Hope for more detail on the inside. It's pretty cool. And it's even got cannons. Oh, what the? What's happening? I think I'm out of body experience there. I love the way the, um, the rays, the sun's dancing across the hull. You can point. You got different different gestures. Hello. Yeah, okay. Apparently there's no plans for voice chat. Uh, which kind of makes half makes sense. There's actually uh, full face masks actually allow divers to communicate with my voice. Um, oh wow. There's another pearl I guess. implemented that system. So I'm kind of I'm half wondering Ooh Islands. I'm half wondering if you can only communicate by voice if you have a full face mask or if you'll be, do be able to do it regardless. Swim up to the crow's nest. Oh, there's seahorses there. That is awesome. I love seahorses. I'll take a photograph for sure. She's with shizzles. very skinny. I think there's an invisible wall there. Oh, it's so cool. I like this game. It's so relaxing. I love diving. I guess that's part of why I love this game. That wasn't a pearl. That was a mission. I don't care about missions. A 
pearls. That looks far away. I'm gonna use my vertigo. Why'd they call it a vertigo? What is that? What a weird looking coral. I hope they do uh, a bit more work on the sound effects. Uh, a big thing of diving for me is the, the way everything sounds. Uh, I know that sounds kind of weird because you're underwater, but just even things like the sound of the breathing, um, the sound of the currents, uh, I guess you would say, the big thing. Um, you can hear a lot when you're underwater, although it's not what you're used to, obviously, uh, being on land, but uh, there's a lot to be heard, uh, it's never, it's, it seems kind of silent, but yet it's not silent at all, um, it's actually quite an interesting experience, if you've never been diving before, I would suggest that you go diving, it's a great experience. And you never know, you might find a new sport that you love. Because I love diving, and it's it's a great sport. Really unique. That's a cool touch. I like that. That's very cool. bit unrealistic how I use the air to let out, letting the air out of the BCD. Uh, you're not really supposed to do that. You're supposed to just swim and then use the BCD to stabilize your buoyancy. But it's a game. Whatever. Oh, what the? That is so cool. That's really cool. I'm not sure if that's just not finished yet, or if that's meant to be like that. That's pretty funny. That's cool. <laughs> I wonder if these um these actually save. Oh, oh gosh. 
retrieve camera is meant to be R3, but apparently if you press B, which is the tool, the tool key, it actually retrieves the camera as well, which is kind of annoying. But Let me see if I can take a picture of myself waving. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Hello. So I'm saving those pictures. <laughs> oh, that's cool. No, no. I'm here. Oh, there's a, a what? There's a light. Awesome. a bit more to explore. That was fun. That was really fun. I really enjoyed that. That's what I'm talking about. Having stuff like that just makes all the difference in this game. Stuff to see, really. A lot of fun. Oh, oh, I can see my gums. Can't rotate the, the character. Bit of a shame. Oi. That's awesome, saving that one. Uh, this game rocks. I love this game. Very good. Okay, let's try another, one more scenario, alright, okay, new game, which scenario should I do, Bismarck, 
The Nile Croc sounds pretty cool. I think I've seen this submarine before. Lockheed. That's like an aircraft. Aeroplane, I guess. Bismarck. I don't know what Bismarck is. SS Yongala. I guess that's a type of shipwreck. Let's try Lockheed. This game really has progressed. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool to see. Dive, dive, dive. Ah, oh, dolphin. Yes. That was awesome. All right. Guess what? Target is over here. I'm going to ignore the missions for now. I can do those any other time. For now, I'm just I'm just really excited to explore the level. Just check it all out. about diving virtually is you don't need to worry about your mask fogging up. I hate it when my mask fogs up. Stuck on a coral. My character is weak sauce. Not just because she's a girl. Because it is what it is. So many red herring oyster bros. I need a tool to open that one. They haven't even made it yet. A fair, a fair amount of detail on that engine. Could be more, but it's pretty good. Need a tool. You're a tool. Doubloon! Yes! I guess this needs a tool. Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. That's cool. Can't exactly swim in there. That'd be cool. Oh, a clownfish! Clownfish! Made famous by Finding Nemo, nonetheless. Less. No other. I don't know. I'm talking crap. Oh. What? Not a single pearl to be found. Is that a hammerhead shark? No. Whew. Although hammerhead sharks are quite friendly. Apparently. Not that I've ever swum with one. I would like to, one day, if I have enough courage. Apparently it's the tiger sharks in the Great Whites that you really need to look out for. Although I was watching a documentary today about a guy who 
quite literally swims with great whites. And I don't mean in cages either. He is quite careful about what he does. He seeks to understand them. Might sound crazy, but it's not that crazy. That was pretty cool, I guess. Not my full these caves. I'm so excited that they have caves planned. Like, I reckon caves are a really cool idea because there'd be so much to see in caves and so much to explore. They can all just be like mazes and they can be really vast and make them really vast. I'm really excited for the future of this game. It's looking great. Great. Ah, oh, it's a turtle. A turtle bro. Dude, he swims pretty fast. I hope they have like deep sea diving. That would be heaps of fun. You'd see like some weird creatures. They could even like almost make up creatures because no one really knows what's down there. No one knows. Scientists don't know. We know a little bit, not everything. That was cool. That was a moment. A moment right there. It's over here. Is that my boat? Yes, it is. Can I get on land? No. Nah. Invisible walls. Oh, starfish. Pointing at all the things. Check out this coral. It's pretty nice, nicely modeled. Oop, missing a texture. Weird looking coral. Soft sponges, I would call them. More than corals, I guess. They don't look very soft, but I'm guessing they are a soft sponge. Might be a bit hard to make them look soft in computer graphics. I don't know. I'm not an expert in these things. I'm, I'm diving in like a bay. Most. It's over there. It's a yacht. Maybe that's where I came from. Nothing. 
got chipped again. Oh, I have an awesome boat. Look at that boat. Look how awesome it is. I want to swim to my boat. What? Not fair. Oh, what? Maybe they only modeled half of it. They want to see the other half. Oh no, it's uh, it's all there. There. Dude. That's it for World of Diving for now. They have sharks in the picture. Why are there no sharks? Can't wait till they have sharks. Action editor. Alright. That's it for my stream tonight, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. And uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for coming. <laughs>